feeding souls. Our last day in Bangkok. The intention for today was to create a mindset of love, peace, and harmony. We started our day about midday in and we went to this beautiful meditation oasis. Our crew really wanted to get a taste of Buddhism and meditation and just a little bit, an understanding of how the Thai culture is enraptured into the religion that is the majority of who we are today. We got to sit with a monk who spoke English, so it was really cool. He explained to us like his daily life, what um, are all the things and the rules that he has to follow, what is a typical day of a monk life. And what was really awesome was he led us through a guided meditation. <laughs> It was one of those moments that you really cannot take back. You savor it and it's just tears were flowing. It was tears of joy, tears of happiness, cleansing. I'm one of the people who actually, when I meditate, I tear. And it actually means that it is the cleansing of the soul. It is really a pure experience. Not everybody does that. I know a few people do, but at the end of the day, everybody meditates and connects with their soul at a different level. We really enjoyed it. We walked along the uh, SkyTrain pathway. We ended our night with a fusion Thai dinner at Chef Charlie Cater's place, Surface, right off of Tong Law. I grew up in Tong Law. It was really just like going home. Charlie, you are amazing. Um, I don't know what to say. I did not know what to expect. I really just left it up to Charlie to create a nice end trip dinner before we send off our crew to the airport and it was just that. The flavors were perfectly balanced, were perfectly right up to the edge. You know that you have met a genius chef when they can season something just right up to the edge of perfection and our souls were fed. Thank you for having us at your place and giving us an awesome time. our last bus ride to the airport. It was full of joyful tears and laughter and fun exchange of what this whole experience, of this whole trip, of what it was all about. Souls were definitely fed. I mean, I cannot count the amount of laughs that we had every single day together or the amount of tears that we shared because our soul honestly truly connected. Um, it was one of those moments where you just go, life is good. It should be this simple. It's always about just connecting with the place, the food, the people the community that you surround yourself with. Thailand gave that to all of us and we had a perfect, perfect trip. It was once in a lifetime experience for a lot of us, but as you know, every journey in life never ends as long as you continue to feed your soul. So continue to feed your soul. Thank you for coming to feed your soul with me. Thank you for feeding my soul. I couldn't be happier for a group to come to Thailand and take you on a journey, a soul-feeding journey through food, culture, and travel. Thank you. Nikki Feeding Souls.